These are my three favorite oil painting brands. I'll tell you a little bit about them and do a quick comparison. I'm going to look at the same two colors for each brand, Yellow Ochre and French Ultramarine. They're all made with a modified linseed oil and professional artist pigments. The pigment for all three of the French Ultramarine is PB29, and for the Yellow Ochre, it's PY42, except for the Daniel Smith, which is PY43. The first brand that's probably the most affordable and easiest to get in both the U.S. and the U.K. is the Artisan Windsor & Newton Water Mixable Oil Color. The second brand I use, which are probably my favorite, are the Royal Talons Cobra Water Mixable Oil Color. These are a little bit pricier than the Artisan, but I love the quality of the paint. And the third brand that I really love to use, but which is quite expensive for me living in England, are the Daniel Smith Water Soluble Oil Colors. I find their paint quality is very similar to the Cobra, and they're lovely to work with. And here they are all laid out next to one another on the palette. The first paint that we'll look at is the Windsor Newton Artisan. This paint is a little bit stiffer than the Cobra and the Daniel Smith, but the pigments are beautiful. They seem to have improved in recent years as well. I remember them being much thicker than they are now. The second brand are the Cobra oils made by Royal Talents. These are the ones I currently use the most. They're great for Alla Prima because if you notice the brush strokes are a bit more pronounced on these. And finally, the Daniel Smith. These are very creamy, almost too creamy sometimes. If you're looking to put down thick paint, these might not be the best choice for you. And here we'll mix the two colors together for each brand. Even though this paint is a bit stiffer than the other two, it mixes nicely and I didn't need to add any medium or oil with this. The Cobra also mixes really nicely together. And again, I like the fact that when I lay the paint down, I can see the brush strokes. The Daniel Smith, by comparison, is very wet. Interestingly, however, I can still see a great variety in the brush strokes when I put it on the canvas. And here they all are side by side. You can see the differences in brush strokes a little bit better when you get close up. I decided to use a little bit of the Artisan Thinner on the mix to show how that thins down the different paints. With the Cobra, it goes down very grainy, while the Daniel Smith is very transparent. A second coat makes them a bit more creamy, but they don't have the luminosity of the Windsor & Newton. I do like that I can get both looks out of the Cobra, though. What do you think? What's your favorite?